Hey YouTube, what's up? Welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be showing you guys something that has been very, very highly requested. Well, not necessarily directly to me, but fans of 30 Virus and some other YouTubers maybe will know that there is a way on Hypixel if you play Skyblock to view every single fairy soul with the waypoints mod. And some people have been wondering how 30 Virus does this. I'll put an image on screen of like what it looks like. Some people have been wondering how does this work? How do you install this? Is it free? Where can I get this? Is it bannable? And I'm here to answer all those questions and show you how to install it. So guys, let's get into the video. <laughs> Okay, so the first question we have is, is it bannable? Um, no, it is not bannable in any way on the Hypixel network. You cannot get banned for this at all. It's not bannable. Bottom line, it's not bannable, and it's it, it's extremely useful. Um, so that it's not bannable. It's free. Yes, it's completely free. Uh, it is updated for the new hub, too. So that's great. But guys, why don't I show you how to install it really quickly? All right, so guys, the first thing you're going to want to do is have Badline installed. If you don't have it installed, I will have a link in the description. Uh, there, I'll also have a tutorial coming out soon on how to install Badline properly. So that you can click on it, and it doesn't ask you for admin privileges. It'll just open up. It's crazy. I know you guys are probably completely curious at, at how I ever managed to do that without the admin privileges and stuff. I'll show you guys in a video to make it not notify you. And that's another video. So go look for that on my channel coming out really shortly. But once you have Badline installed, link in the description for Badline, obviously. Next, what you're going to want to do is download the JSON file to this profile. So basically, if that makes no sense to you guys, don't worry. You don't need to understand it. You just need to download it. And this is updated to the new hub again. So it's very easy. It'll work flawlessly. Go to the link in the description. And the second you click on it, It'll download it. So 30 virus BLC profile, and I have it as one, but it'll just say 30 virus BLC profile. And then what you're going to want to do with this, make sure bad lines closed, by the way. It's okay if it's not closed. Close it right now before you actually do this because it, it you need to close it and reopen it anyways for the profile to take effect, I believe. But close bad line and obviously close file explorer and stuff. But then press the Windows key and R because this method will likely only work on Windows. You can do it on Mac, but you have to know where the BLC profile folder is, and I don't know how you really do that. It's in your .minecraft folder, so on Mac OS. Uh, I, I am not going to be doing that in this video because I'm sure most of you guys use Windows anyways, and a lot of you guys that use Mac may not use Badline. But yeah, anyways, percent app data percent slash dot minecraft. I'll leave the command in the description. Again, that is Windows plus the R key. And then type in percent app data percent slash dot minecraft. Again, you can copy paste in the description and then press OK. And then it'll open up your dot minecraft folder. And this is very important because what you'll need to do is double click on BL client mod profile. And you'll see that I already have it in here, but I actually don't have the one for the new hub. So I'm going to delete that one because that one's for the old hub. And then what you're going to want to do is obviously show this in folder. So make sure that you can see it. And I'm going to delete this one right here and just rename this one really quickly. But yeah, anyways, guys, you'll see the file here in your downloads folder. And then drag it. Hover over this. Hover over that. And then drag it into BL client mod profile. So you have 30 virus BLC profile.json. Close both of those and then start up Badline client. And I'll show you guys exactly what happens now because you're not done. You have to switch to the profile, which if you don't know how to do, I will show you exactly how to. Go to play. Uh, 1.8.9 will work the best for this. I don't know if it'll work in future versions or not. Uh, I don't know if profiles, I think they'll work in every version, but just to be safe. Use 1.8.9 because I've tested it. I know it works. Badline's default is 1.8.9 anyways because that's the point of it to be played with in 1.8.9. But yeah, just open up Badline just like this. And then once it's open, obviously you can go on to Hypixel, which is exactly what I'm going to do to show you guys because you need to be on a server. I'll do slash skyblock. 
And I'll show you guys. Look, so obviously since you've been away, you've earned 153k coins as interest. That is a lot of interest. Oh wow, I used to be earning like 2k. But anyways, I'll go to the hub and I'll show you guys how this thing works exactly. So press right shift on your keyboard or whatever key you have assigned. It should be right shift by, or not right shift, I'm sorry, left shift on your keyboard. By default, it should be left shift. Left shift, I'm sorry, it's not right shift, I'm dumb. Um, but anyways, left shift on your keyboard should bring up this menu. If not, it could be a different key, but then you've probably remapped it yourself. Anyways, you'll see this mods menu. Just if you don't see it, then click on this mods tab up here. Maybe one more time because it's possible that you could be in these settings. Then just click on mods and stuff. Anyways, once you're on this page, click on configure mod profiles. And then you'll see default and then you'll see 30 virus BLC profile. All you have to do is click on the profile and then you'll see so many things. So many waypoints highlighted in red. But that's confusing, right? That's really, really confusing. There's so many of them. Also, I like how he's added the thing where it does that. I did not have that in my old profile. But anyways, uh, as you guys can see, there's so many things. Uh, you know what's very annoying about this is you have to actually disable each one of these one by one. Or you can just keep them all on and find them. But anyways, to disable and enable them like 30 virus does, go and search for waypoints right here, and then you can turn off and on, but click on settings. And then as you'll see, there's some boxes checked that you are going to need to uncheck so that it's a clean slate just like this. So watch guys, it needs to be clean. Uncheck every single box. I know it's gonna take a while. I don't know if there's an alternative to just uncheck every box at once. I don't think there is. It's not a big deal, just uncheck them all. But anyways, once you can look around and see that there is nothing over here, then as you guys can see, uh, you've removed all the fairy soul waypoints things. Congratulations. But how do you actually see each individual fairy soul? Easy, press right shift and it should bring you back to this menu. If not, you have to go for mods to waypoints, search for it, just way and then tap settings and then you can find it. Just check whatever fairy soul you wanna find and then bam, it should highlight it with the beacon. So as you guys can see, I believe it is all the way over there. Yep, you can see the red text on my screen. And all you have to do is actually run to it. And as you guys can see, the red text will get closer and closer and bigger and bigger. And once you're there, just like this, then you just click on the fairy soul. And this thing is very, very accurate. You, you guys don't have to doubt this at all. It's extremely accurate is my point because I don't know if 30 actually made this because it would take a long, long time to make. But either way, uh, it's incredible. Why, why lag? Thank you, lag. There we go. And then look, you just click on it and then bam, you found your fairy soul. And that's literally it. It's so amazing. And then once you want to find the next one, uncheck this, check the next one. And then bam, it shows you where the next one is. Now my old one was in white text, so I'm not used to this red, but I mean, yep, there it is. And then you just go over to it. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this tutorial. Once you want to turn that all the way off, like you want to go back to your defaults, configure mod profiles, default, and then it'll switch you back. Although it won't make that much of a difference most of the time. But I'd recommend playing with his mod profile all the time anyways. If this video helped you out, maybe consider subbing to the channel because it would be much appreciated. I did put some work into this video. Uh, I was on vacation for a few days, so that's why I didn't make this right away when some people were asking. But better late than never, I was on vacation. I couldn't, I, I had my old crappy laptop. I couldn't just make a YouTube video. But anyways, guys, uh, if this video helped you out, again, make sure to like and sub. A sub would be massively appreciated. It would help out the channel because YouTube does unsub people it's random uh no one knows why some people suspect it's random number generator some people suspect that it's just youtube being youtube no one knows really but we're gonna take a trip into the void and other than that oh i just lost 1000 coins uh, that's a problem lag back what's happening to my connection i swear guys I, I have really really good internet i have like 500 megabits per second what Excuse me. Thank you. Can we? Oh, well, okay. Whatever. It's fine. Um, But yeah, guys. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Again, a sub would be massively appreciated. Make sure to leave a like as well. 
and I'll catch you guys in the next video on the channel. Maybe I'll do, if you don't want to install this or don't have bad line or something, I'll do a video on each of the locations and where the waypoints are, like, in every place. So that'll be cool. Uh, yeah, again, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next video.